Hey everyone, Sibling Story with a another review. Today we are going to be looking at this Avatar Aang figure. It's a really nice figure, so let's get right into it. So here is the Avatar figure. It comes with a really cool little staff here. It's a really nice staff. It's just a little plastic bendable painted one. It's just, I wish it had wings or something that could pop out or something. I, I don't know. I don't know if that would be possible or not to do. But yeah, that's that's good uh, for that. Uh, it can snap into his hand. You just gotta really just really press it in there to be able to, and that's another nitpick I have. I just wish it was easier to pop in. It requires, and it can come off real, really easily, like, like really easily. But anyway, you can hold it. Really cool. Here's, comes with a base, which I wish it said Avatar, or had it engraved on there, but eh, it's just a plastic base on the bottom. I don't know if you can see that, but it's just by Com. 2019 uh, ink. This is, uh, I like the face a little bit. It's not the best face, but it's like nice uh, painted features. It looks exactly like the cartoon or anime or whatever you want to call it. I'm not going to call it an anime because it's not, but uh, yeah, it has a few marks on it. It got it like about a month or two ago, so it's really nice. Oh, uh, whoops. You can see there's like a little purple scratch on there or something. Yeah, it has the arrow details everywhere. It's really cool. Up the head, so. Oh, sorry, something fell. Uh, here is the head. The head can turn. Yeah, I really like that. I wish it was a little bit better, though. Uh, it's really hard to articulate. Like, the wrists are fine, but like the arms, they're like this like part of the arm you can't really twist it that much and it's like really hard to like twist and make it go it's like mm. and it, it requires you can hear the like kind of squeaking sound i wish it didn't do that and it was easier to pose and stuff but that's just another nitpick for me it's just oh the stand fell off you can put a little peg there and then there's a little peg there you could make them stand. You got articulation in the knees. This one's really hard, but this one's really easy. His waist can turn and, you know, do that. He can do, like, a back a back kick. He can do a front kick. You can do that if you wanted to. You can do a side kick like this. You know, really, really nice figure, honestly, and... It, this is the Diamond Selects one available at Walgreens, so it you can get it at Walgreens for about 20 bucks. It's a pretty good figure for that price, but it's, there's so many things that are a little bit off with it. But like I, I don't I don't care. This is like the best ink figure you could probably buy for under fifty dollars because th these are like the other ones that are Diamond Select and they are like older, those are like $50, but this is like $20 at Walgreens. Uh, I've tried and I failed to find Katara for the same price, or Zuko for the same price, but I wish they would have made Soccer or Ta for Fire Lord of Zyre or, or something like that, but like, they only have the basic three for now, but yeah, that's... That's pretty much it, so if you like the video, please like and subscribe, and see you next time, and I hope you enjoyed our little Coco dancing video, that was pretty funny, but go check that one out if you're new, bye-bye.